nice. Pluto, <laughs> sweet man. Nice. There you go, you guys. Pluto, right there. We've been checking out Pluto this whole time in VR. Super freaking cool. Awesome. <laughs> <laughs> Right. <laughs> uh, how, how, hold on, let me see if I can. There we go. There you go. <laughs> nice. <laughs> okay, you know what? Now, now, now. No, you know what? I'm still live. I'm still live. Hello and welcome back to another Reality Check VR video. I just want to tell you guys, I'm freaking excited to show you this video. I just got done recording some in-game, in-Steam VR footage with uh, Sean and Forrest, uh, some of the creators of Pluto VR. They're some of the developers of that, and it's just, it's just an amazing, an amazing thing right here. It allows you to basically communicate with your friends, see your friends, and you know, just hang out with your friends in virtual reality in Steam VR while you're playing other games or even just sitting in the menu. So it, it brings that aspect of social VR into your home, which is something you know that should have just been integrated into both of these systems from the get-go. At least you would have assumed so, considering that it is virtual reality, right, guys? Anyway, so I'm going to show you guys what we recorded and hope you guys enjoy the footage. So see you in the next one later. Okie dokie. I'm going to go into settings. Right. right. Left. left. Okay, you can hear that. Test mic. Microphone, microphone, microphone. Yeah, avatar. Avatar. No glasses. Isn't that right? Finished. Steam friends online. Join with visuals. Join audio only. See Steam friends online. What? Do you have any idea what this is? It's Pluto VR. It's allowing me to talk to my friends in VR. No matter what they're doing. No matter what they're playing. I'm going to join with visuals. I have no idea what that means. I'm probably going to have to... So we're going to go ahead and hit join with visuals. We're having an active conversation. Hello. What's up, Forrest? How's it going? Not, not too bad. Too bad. I, I hit um, audio and visuals, but I don't see anything. Oh. Well, I had to, uh, had to opt into that. Okay. But yeah, as far as uh, the UI goes, do you see just your normal Steam VR UI, right? Is that? Yeah. Gotcha, gotcha. So I'm over to your left now. Are you wearing the headset? Oh no. No, 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 no. Wait a second. Wait a second. Uh, uh, uh. Hey, hold on. That's that that did get me a little bit. That that freaked me out just a bit. All right. Good old in ear rift headphone thing. So I can hear when they're not in, but they have to actually totally be in for me to hear. So can okay. you see my avatar now as well? I can. I can see you. You're right there. That's, That's where you pretty are. crazy. You seem pretty tall over there, man. Yeah. Are you using the Oculus as well? I mean, what is this? Um, yeah, I'm on the touches. You can, I can see the fingers moving like that. So how I, do you see fingers and hands for me as well? Uh, I see hands and fingers. So you can turn them on and off. So in your Pluto menu, you go uh -huh. to the Steam dashboard. Right. Steam dashboard is... Mm -hmm. I'm in the... I'm, I, I, see, nice I, see, I see Sean Ball. Yeah. What? So what's up, dude? This is insane. He's like he's like bouncing around me. So oh, hey, what's up, man? What's going on, dude? So okay, so I'm I'm in the I'm in the Steam VR menu right now. So if you on the so you should see a couple balls. You see the yeah, screen, whoa. You see desktop and you see a Pluto. One. You guys totally hacked into it. All right, yes, Pluto. I see it there. I see it there. Yeah, and then you'll have show and hide hands. And so right now, uh, uh -huh. people still see your hands, but you will um, still see you the trollers. See for yourself. Um, you'll still see the controllers right now. Uh, and the way it works is when you're out of the dashboard, uh, we don't, SteamVR doesn't support native touch um, handling events yet. So like yep. uh, all the different na natural human poses it doesn't do yet. So you just have to wiggle the joystick around to, you and touches, right? You said? Yeah, yeah. Okay. Um, so when you're out of the dashboard, if you, you can you see your hands? Turn yes, I can see the hands now. I just need to get out of the so dashboard, I guess. So Turn the dashboard off. Okay. And now if you wiggle ah. the joystick around and pull the trigger, you'll see the different I just gestures you're making. I certainly have the fist. I don't have the the thumbs like you do. Unless, so if oh. you push the the joysticks in different directions. Uh -huh. there you go. So yeah, that's. I mean, this is a remnant of that was right. originally designed for the Vive. Yeah, exactly. Hey, uh, originally designed for the Vive, <laughs> and now um, it, it's mapped one to one with a touch, so it's a little different. 
Right on, right on. No, that's cool. That's awesome. So, I mean, I, I, I get what you're saying as far as uh, that way everybody has hand gestures. So, no matter if I'm using a Vive or an Oculus, we can both point and give each other high fives. No lewd gestures. Awesome. Good for you guys. No. Yeah, no, pointing is the, is, the, is really the, the one of the biggest things. I mean, being able to point to something. So, you guys have uh, definitely been doing something really cool. I'm very surprised to see you here in my world. So, I assume you guys see the same Steam VR worlds that you normally are living in, right? Yeah, as well correct. that's cool so you don't actually uh, take me out of my place that's what that's kind of the biggest thing i was kind of wondering how you would be in my bubble with me um and i guess the next question goes is so can you guys be here when i'm playing a game yeah, Whoa, yeah. so the one thing i will something. say is if you're on if you're on oculus um there are still some bugs with some uh different steam games so if you launch certain games on steam it will natively switch over to um uh there are loot gestures as you found uh, no no no, no. <laughs> it will natively it'll natively switch over to um the oculus runtime as opposed to using the steam vr one so that's one thing to keep in mind we have to make sure you use applications right that, that are in steam uh, that are in steam so. yes and that, and that makes sense because i mean there's a few different things that i mean deal that way but that also is the way that it should be at this time so i mean uh, I get that Oculus takes over a lot of things with certain games, but there's only a few games in the Steam store that kind of put you into Oculus uh, mode, yeah, I guess. So, exactly. so you're jumping in the lab. He's in Google VR Earth VR right now. Correct. Yeah. And I can see. I like how it shows above above you guys. Like, how many people can be in an active conversation? I guess that's the next question. No uh, limit at the moment, I don't think. Yeah, there's no hard limit right now. Um, it kind of breaks down socially and headset wise. Like, we have all hands meetings in here. We have 13 people. <laughs> uh, nice because that's if we can have at least you know six or seven or even eight guys in here i mean podcasts like we've, we've been forever wanting a way that we could sit here and all jump in in one spot and virtually talk to each other and be in the same space and i think that this really is probably the best way so far that i've been seeing you know that i could think of to do that you know with, and we can all be playing other games and showing those off while we're still talking to each other so that's exactly that's pretty awesome here man actually show you guys a little sample of where i'm at right now Oh yeah, you, that's, oh there it is. What? Screenshot from Sean. So you took a screenshot of the Earth. Where are you at at Google Earth right there? Somewhere in like Italy. I was gonna say that looks like Italy. Nice, nice. So uh, to take the screenshot, did you go into your Pluto dashboard then? No, it's, so we made it a shortcut. You hold down the trigger and then you press the menu button. Oh, that's even easier. And the menu button, like uh, the Steam VR menu, right? Because yeah. uh, on the or... Oculus, no, on the Oculus. It's the menu menu button. So I think on the Oculus it's, trigger and b but you have to be inside an experience right experience. right no i'm gonna i'm gonna have to jump into experience i mean I, if so I, we can still see each other as we're in the experience though is that okay because right. i'm i'm freaking out here okay i need to be able to you guys have been used to this this is new to me all right so uh, i'm trying enough. to think of what game i should jump into real quick that would be fun to play right. while i can mm -hmm. see other people mm -hmm. something scary maybe mm -hmm. no Oh my, okay, this is kind of funny. There's an in-game robot, and you're exactly where he's looking at me at, so, yeah. Oh, I'm an in-game robot. <laughs> exactly. That's awesome. This is pretty cool right here. So, yeah, this is actually going to help for a lot of uh, scary games, because, you know, oh yeah, there's a lot There's a lot that I always want to nope out of. Yeah, it helps, it helps you keep... Ooh, is he Spider-Manning there? Is that... It's the Brooklyn Bridge I've found. You see that white wall in front of you? Try walking towards it by holding your grip buttons and moving your uh, So in this game, you walk by moving your hands left and right. That's interesting. Oh, interesting, yeah. So, okay, so now you're in this game. Try pulling the right trigger and then pressing B. Okay, I'm sorry. One more time. Oh, we take a picture? Oh, wait, wait. I, I, I did it. Let's see if you just... There, I'm just going to send... Move on to the next level. <laughs> oh, so I hold the trigger and I push B? Yeah, processing screenshot. I see it. Cool. Nice. Oh. There you are. <laughs> See climbing now. Yeah, so um, where's the robot that you were standing on? Where is he? Um, I got to get up to the top of this thing. There we go. Um, I don't see the robot anymore. Oh, he's gone. Okay, I'll, I, I'll, I'll, I'll hold the trigger again, and I'm going to hold B. You'll see the, the flag for the end here. Yeah. Nice. Hey. Yeah. Nice. See? That's right. It's kind of cool. That's awesome. So I'm gonna, how do I go forward? Um, so, Sean, we felt ah, bad. Of Ooh, you guys, I figured out how to jump now. Hold on. So I'm going to show you here. I've got this big gap in front of me, and I want you guys to see it. So okay. I'm going to hold my trigger, and I'm going to hold my B button. That's a big gap right there i got to get across. Ooh, see that gap? That's a big one. Is it uh, like, have you tried, um, oh, what's it called? Lucid Trips? 
I have not. There's there's so many I, good things I, I have uh, not tried. <gasps> I have a similar two-handed locomotion mechanic that's really cool. All right, this push off the ground. I'm gonna show you right here, so you can see now where I came from, right? That's so I, I made it right to do that jump right there. You hold your triggers and you literally like throw yourself up in the air, like you know what I mean? Yeah. You, yeah. Like 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 you see how my hands are doing this right here? Huh. Yep. That's how you jump in the game. Huh. So I'm jumping up and down right now. Whew. I'm flying. <laughs> <sighs> but then to walk you do this to walk you go like that and you walk forward so now that i'm walking totally make me sick. I no can't. no it works it works because you have to be looking the direction that is moving oh i'm just crazy sensitive to it so you're sort of unnatural locomotion you're kind of like me you get queasy very easy huh yeah queasy very easy so i'm gonna go ahead and hit this button to go back to the steam vr menu and exit so what I've noticed is I get like maybe, I get maybe about one second, maybe one second of jitter as I'm loading in and out of the games, which is a little unnatural, but that's probably because we're running this, but it instantly smooths back out once the game actually starts. So I don't actually get any lag in game, which is nice. So yeah. um, that's, that's There's a lot awesome. of transitions between the dashboard, which the, um, not all of it is us, it is just turning the dashboard on and off for certain things can cause some issues, but... Um... <laughs> no, this is awesome. So in the menu, you can just go to reset positions. So you get in a comfortable where you want to be, and then click that button, and you'll reset the positions to make it oh, more natural. Oh, oh, dude, I got I. So wait, so, wait, you? I'm, I'm, I'm using exactly what you're saying to do the opposite. That's gonna be fun. Okay, so reset positions. Boom. There you go. There we go. Yeah, yeah, right. That's what we wanted, right? But now you yep. guys don't realize what you did. Oh yeah. Uh, no, no. That's right. No, you, can't reset, reset you, can't you can't get away. You can't get away. You can't get away from. I got so much space. You have no idea how much space I have. <laughs> Run into my chair. Oh, oh, I have. There's a table here. All right. There's a. I made, you really, I made you really translucent, so you can change your opacity. <laughs> Why won't he go away uh, when I reset positions? You're next to my, yourself, you're next to my couch, Sean. Oh, yeah, you're right. Oh, yeah. You go. <laughs> oh, guys. <laughs> he didn't... He, he turns into a ball. I love how he turns into a ball. The sound effect is, is really what makes that. <laughs> um, did you see the opacity option as well? So um, change the opacity of the avatars uh, so if you want a little less you can go to 50 percent a lot less 10 percent yeah so if you're like in a in oh if, in a game i see right yeah oh. and so you can go completely not you know audio only or you oh no this is great yeah see 10 percent. i mean i would i would never take them off but you know obviously unless you're doing something where you're in a uh, some kind of a crazy game. See, what's going to get unreal here is, I mean, and I'm sure you guys are going to keep doing all kinds of awesome stuff, but yeah, at some point people are going to say, well, wait, people are going to be cheating in games because they'll have friends showing them all kinds of stuff that we can't see. And I think that's awesome. I think that's, <laughs> I think that's, I think that's pretty, that's the whole purpose of being in virtual reality is that you're like, wait, you don't know what he sees. He's got 13 people in front of him giving him answers. <laughs> like, seriously. Rainbow's End. I will if it's got something cool to do with, you know, this stuff. Oh, yeah. It does. Rainbow's End. There's a whole, like, one sci -fi. of the is, is, well, sci-fi, yep. it's all aug mixed reality augmented reality. Nice, primarily. nice, and nice. So, one of the main premises is you're having these kind of virtual, like, conversations like this. Mm -hmm. And so, there'll be, like, you know, Sean will be invisible to you, and he'll be talking to me, and, like, uh -huh. having a conversation while I'm talking to you. And Right, right, right. I get it. described is that... Mm -hmm, mm -hmm, mm -hmm, for sure. So I, 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 there's a Cicada project or something I was going to read that's got some similar things to do with augmented reality and people talking with people who are walking down the street. You know, you think about the cell phones being weird in your, in your head when you're walking down talking to, you know, somebody. And now people are literally going to be seeing people as they're moving right. around. Can't wait for those. Uh, yeah, <laughs> too soon for some people. But no, no, I think this is great. I mean, right now, for, for the purposes that this has, this is a feature that I, I, I firmly believe people wished was at launch for all these VR systems. I mean, to be able to have your friends in there. This almost seems like something like back in the day, you know, Nintendo days with the Wii. We could jump in. We had friends, little avatars and you know this seems very fit so i think you, you guys are doing great work this is awesome cool. um i do I, i'm gonna ask is, is this stuff i think you've said it before is this stuff public to show right now as an alpha user you're welcome to do whatever you want um and share whatever you want and what's that home. super old bridge in london it's the london bridge <laughs> as well um and that doesn't hide or show them for other people it just hides or show them for yourself right now but that's an interesting thing to think about steam is telling us which hand is which uh -huh. Yes, yeah, I see what you're talking about. Did you know I can count my fingers? One, two, three, four. Very good. Oh wait, Caleb. no, he didn't do it. Oh. He didn't do it yet. 
Sive? Yes, Sive. So we're, are, is this like a <laughs> Skype call that we're on, basically? Yeah, well, actually, no, we're actually, from what I was explained to by them, we're using your cell phone minutes and just yours. Uh, but specifically, yeah, roaming. Yeah, yours. Yes. Out of, out of, out of, um, I mean, this is, right now, <laughs> think of it is this is just a conversational group. Like, imagine that we are standing around at a conference um, and that it was a uh, only slightly friendly conference in which only people you knew, uh, only people you knew could walk up and say hi. So right yeah. now, um, because this is still very early alpha, it is it is all open. So if you have a friend who knows you and is friends with you on Steam, they could just jump in if they have Pluto. So, so the, but like, would they be in this instance of Pluto's? I guess is what I'm asking. Or would it be a new instance, like a new Skype group Skype call? Uh, it depends on a technical level. I mean, if they join this, they would join this. Yeah, okay. they, they would be here with all of us still. They wouldn't just see just you. Um, but one question I do have to ask. Oh, sorry. No, go ahead. Go ahead. Continue. Continue. I'll, I'll, I'll jump in later. <laughs> I, think he's, I think he's still brushing. Oh yeah. yeah. So what was the question? He's. A... Wait, I'm listening. Oh hey. Just also hey. Still brushing. <laughs> <laughs> Jesus Christ. <laughs> Okay. Uh, yeah. totally. I just took the rainbows away. Interesting. <laughs> this is this is cool, guys. I'm yes, impressed. it's working. It's working. Maybe you guys bet you guys bet you wish you could see what I see right now. Oh crap! Oh crap! I didn't. I showed him. Oh, I'm still I'm I'm still ranked 45th. I thought they reset everything. Well, I guess how do I? There we go. I thought. Oh, so I have to kind of turn my. Yeah. Well, I can see it when you get up close. Really? Oh, yeah, whoa, yeah. that's weird. The resolution increases. 18. So, wait, oh, yeah, damn it. So, 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 like, where, wherever you start wow, pressing the B cool. button is where it starts to get you. There we go. There we go. So, that, that oh, was. Oh, nice. Ah, oh, nice. 45th. That's from a while ago, though. I haven't, I haven't. <laughs> right behind the NDA toilet. <laughs> <laughs> Aww. Uh, that's it. Sorry, sorry, bro. That's it. <laughs> yeah. <laughs> All right, they're going down. Well, I gotta go. Uh, I gotta head out. But it was awesome uh, chatting with you. And yeah, um, good job, guys. This is awesome. Thank you. And anytime you wanna uh, just say hi, if we're online, just just jump in and say hi. For sure, for sure. I appreciate you being here, showing me this stuff around. And I'm certainly going to be. Uh, I'm gonna. I'm gonna post some of this. Uh, I'm gonna have to just cut through some of this video and post it online because I think people are gonna freak out at least the people that I, a lot of people I know don't know about this even though I, I did try to tell one guy the other day that came over about it uh, this buddy of mine named Chris I was like so there's this thing called Pluto VR and he's like I know all about it I'm like okay I'm like never mind then never mind so uh, that's awesome and I don't know if you can tell right now but I am fighting some I am fighting some robots right now oh I can see I can see what weapon you're using too the beams right I was I was actually using uh, the 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 bullets with that that yes exactly. But I had the mod. Uh, okay, hold on, let me see if I can. There we go. There you go. <laughs> wait, wait, you better you better be careful what you say. I got. Go ah! <laughs> Static oh no, so if you are, you get out of the dashboard, <laughs> and then yeah. just gently touch your thumb on the touch pads. Oh, nice. Yeah, so we do have the ability to have some different gestures. Oh god, this the, is uh, going to be, <laughs> VR chat also has the exact same thing, but different gestures, so now my brain is going to be oh, no. like, that's yeah. going to be funny. <laughs> it really is like learning a new language every time there's like a new... It'll be, it'll be all that's natural great. pretty soon. Once the touches get fully supported, it'll just... And, you know, well, I like how we can have a conversation. You guys can just be here, and I can kind of half listen to it. And at the same time, I'm playing. And you guys are in full opacity right now, you know, 100%. And it's still it's really not bothering me. Um, and if it did, of course, I could turn it down, which is awesome. So, and uh, yeah, that's that's great. So, <laughs> cool. cool. <laughs> okay, you know what? Now, now, now. No, you know, I'm still alive. I'm still alive. Okay, you know what? No, no I'm taking. I'm, 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 I'm letting it kill me right there. 
Cool, nice. cool. All right, well, I'll probably I'll probably jump off right now because I know you know just gotta go get some other stuff done. But this is this is great. This is the the beginning of something big right here. I'm really excited to see where this program goes, and of course what you guys continue to do. So, Ooh, nice, nice. wow, did you just draw that while we were talking? Yep. This dude's over here freaking Tesla coiling it up, and you, you guys yeah. about you guys about to when we disappear in a black hole, we'll know why next time. Rock paper scissors. Wait, scissors. But you can't do scissors though, so that way we wait. And the scissors I would think be. I've the, been doing this. Yeah, that's scissors, scissors, right? Yeah, that would have to be scissors. And then you got the paper. With right. The open palm. Right. I'm not oh. sure how you guys do the open palm. It might be down. Well, mine's. Yeah, it, yeah, you're right. It is kind of down. Uh -huh. Scissors. Oh, I got it. So rock, paper, scissors. Rock, yeah, yeah. paper, scissors. <laughs> wait, wait, wait. It's one, two, three. Yeah. Shoot. Yeah. Okay. Okay. <laughs> okay. You ready? Wow. Yep. Like every one. time it happens. <laughs> Right, one, one, two, two three, three, shoot! shoot. Oh. Uh, 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 he snips you. He snips you. I don't yeah, know. But, I but before he snips you, before he snips you, I went, Psh, and then you covered. Uh, <laughs> you saved me. And then That's I right. murdered you. Oh, you know what? Oh, cool. You know what? Fuckers. I'll just, I'll just hug you. I will never. I would never. I would never. I would. <laughs> How low do you think you can go? You realize I'm tracked all the way. I'm tracked all the way. <laughs> People are always asking, they're like, can you actually get onto the ground real quick? I'm just going to show you guys real quick. Let's see if I can get on the ground. Yes, yep. I can get on the ground. I can actually, like, lay on the ground, and I can army crawl. Oh, all right. <laughs> Dude, on my screen, you were army crawling around London. Right now, like, oh, really? Pretty far zoomed out map London. It looks awesome. Oh. Oh. Wow. You're crushing <laughs> Take that, London, and your chocolate factories. Okay. All right. <laughs> That's awesome. And you know what? For me, I'm actually looking at a big planet of the Earth right now, too, so it's kind of funny. I actually, I'm not really sure. It's not a real planet, so. Oh, you're in your compositor? Yeah, well, I'm in, I'm in the Steam VR, but I've got that, I've got that weird yeah. globe underneath me, which is, looks pretty cool, so. And, like, so what, I'm, I'm going to swap to a beard and Harry Potter glasses. <laughs> <laughs> yeah. So you can do that, like, instantly. Uh, as long as you just... So, let me get rid of the beard and we'll swap back to glasses. <laughs> Boom. Nice, nice. Yeah, clean. I, that's, that's, I'm, I'm clean cut now. Like that, it would be great is you have to like come into a meeting and be like, be like, uh, oh, 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 and then psh, that'd be awesome, man. <laughs> totally do that. <laughs> right. Well, that would actually be kind of fun when somebody's like doing something the whole time and you're just like, they don't know you're in there, but you're just like, hey, what's up? <laughs> If, if only we had haptics. If only we had haptics, and we could just like just... haptics on the back of their neck. Uh -huh. just... Hey there, buddy. I haven't used Topush this much actually in a while. Oh, nice. Pluto, <laughs> so sweet, man. Nice. There you go, you guys. Pluto, right there. We've been checking out Pluto this whole time in VR. Super freaking cool. Awesome. Well, that's it. That's it, man. That's it. We're, we're jumping out of Pluto right now. Right now. Sean, Sean, I appreciate you. you you're showing me around again, man. Thanks, I do appreciate yeah, it. No and it's good Bye. to meet you. Good to meet you, buddy. Noah, certainly. I'll, I'll see both you guys in VR now that we're in. Now that we got Pluto connected, I will be seeing you guys all the time. So yeah, whether people know I it or not. Steam or something. <laughs> Later, broskies. Bye. Wait, how do I get? How do I get out of here? You guys are with me. Uh, oh no! <laughs> oh no! And then in the upper left of the Pluto UI, there's a quit button that'll kill Pluto. I don't want to kill Pluto. How do I normally leave Steam VR? Oh, over here. That's how I, yeah, I have to get out of Steam VR. So, all right. Later, Gators. Bye. That was crazy. It's freaking crazy. biggest things i mean being able to point to something <laughs> yeah right <laughs> there you go there the first one there the very he has someone had to do it somebody's been practicing <laughs> uh, thanks for that john <laughs> just doing my job